Let's say I want to see bigger charts, but still I want to be able to trade using this order panel here. I can remove my instrument list by pressing here, which will pop up my order panel in a floating window like this, so I can place it wherever I choose it to be. It behaves exactly the same as before with all my shortcuts here and all my expanded options over there for my stop loss, take profit, pending orders and so on. Another cool feature is to set your stop loss, take profit and pending orders directly on a chart. So here I see the great opportunity to put my stop loss here and my take profit here. And these are drafting stop loss and take profit for the order I'm about to execute if I press this buy button. But before, I want to convert this order to risk manage order and say I want to risk my $100. So if my stop loss gets hit, I will lose only $100 here. Let's go and execute this trade. After the position has been opened, it will appear on the left side of the screen, indicating my take profit and stop loss at all times. If I click to any of these handles here, I will trigger an edit mode. In this mode, I can tweak my stop loss. Notice that it became blue. This is because there is a change that is yet to be committed. This change has not been submitted yet, so I need to press confirm to change my stop loss. Another cool feature is to place my pending orders directly on the chart. I can go ahead with plus button and press pending. Notice that this is also a draft pending order. It's not yet committed, so I need to press my sell or buy to ex actually execute this order. I can also place stop loss, take profit here for this pending order and execute it over there.